Avanil Kumar sharing with you test problems. Let us do them, practice and get better. Here we have three examples in which we have common factors which you need to visualize and rearrange and then factor. The question is factor the following. Three of them are there for you. I'd like you to copy these questions and answer the question. Let's do them one by one. The first one is 2a times b minus 3c minus 5 times b minus 3c. Now b minus 3c is a common factor between these two terms. So straight away we can write b minus 3c as common. We are left with 2a from the first term minus 5 from the second. So that is how it should be factored. Now let's analyze the second one which is 5x times y minus c plus z minus y. Hmm. Now z minus y we could rearrange. See how. We could write this as 5x times y minus c. Now if I factor minus outside and write y first since y is here then what do I get? Minus y minus c. Do you see that? So we get y minus c as a common factor. Now we can factor this. y minus c is a common factor. We get 5x from the first term. And what do we get here? Minus 1. Minus 1. Good. This time we have three terms, but very similar to the previous one. You can pause the video, factor this one, then look into my solution. So we have a common factor here, b minus c, b minus c, but this one is c minus b. Let's make it b minus c by changing the sign. So we'll do that. So first we'll write this as 2a times b minus c plus d times b minus c. So we'll change the sign negative of negative becomes positive. So we'll write b minus c here. Check it out. If you open, you get minus c plus b. If you open, minus c plus b. Same thing. Do you see that? So it works. So that is how you should be doing it. And now we can factor, correct? So let me write down this factor here itself as equals to b minus c is common, right? b minus c is common. You're left with minus 2a in the first term plus d plus 1. And that is the answer, correct? So that is how you can factor these terms. I hope that helps. Thank you.